In this video tech tip, I'm going to show you all of the different hole filling options we have in our tech studio. I'm using this scan, the rear end of an old vehicle, as a demonstration piece. It was collected with the Artec Leo. The first option we have for hole filling is inside the fusion commands. One option is the all or watertight option. It's excellent for 3D printing because it generates a watertight mesh, but as you'll see from the gray data below, it may not be representative of the original part. Next, there's the radius threshold, which lets you do hole filling and fill small holes without creating too much extraneous data. The next option, once you have a fusion, is to use the hole filling post-processing command, which lets you fill holes by perimeter. Once you pick that number and apply it, any hole with a perimeter smaller than that threshold will be filled. The final and most powerful tool is the actual fix holes workbench. It sorts all of the data by perimeter length. For example, that's the main piece of data there. And you can sort through any specific hole you want and decide if you want to fill it. By clicking on that radio box, we can say to fill that hole and the Artec Studio will patch it in. Thank you very much.